an artist is an uncertain and financially vulnerable career, but in the past 29 years, passion and hard work of a few of our South African young artists has been rewarded with the Standard Bank Young Artist Awards. We caught up with two of this year's winners for visual arts and music to find out how they earned this prestigious accolade. Mary the Artist is a maker. I love challenging myself. I like absorbing things that are outside and, and, and actually applying them in my artworks. And I use myself as a model. And that's how I wanted to tell my story. Early in her career, Mary modeled herself into a life-size character called Sophie that she used to express her grandmother's dreams of a bigger life, beyond what was generally possible for black women during apartheid. I think a lot of people encountered my work for the first time in 2010. Art at Work wanted to turn the city into a big giant gallery and the, the city was covered in this billboard with Sophie. As a Standard Bank Young Artist Award winner, Mary had to create a new work for the National Arts Festival. Mary Sabande is on the threshold of a major international career. The main focus of the awards is to give the winners the opportunity to showcase a new work at the festival. Mary's new work was inspired by her own life and times, including the wrenching story of a political protest where people were sprayed with purple dye by the police. The Purple Social Govern came as an idea that I thought, well, Sophie has come to an end. Let me talk about me now as, as a woman practicing in the visual arts. I couldn't help but also uh, put myself in 1989 with the anti-apartheid protesters in Cape Town. We have a painful past, but how do you celebrate sadness? Those are the challenges that makes up my work at this stage. I think it's also an internal struggle that I'm actually working on. How do I move away from Sophie? And this is where the purple figure emerges. I thought of the rhizome and I thought of growth. I started constructing these tentacles like objects, taking the space. The pebble will actually take over the whole body that is carrying these roots that are growing each and every day. And she will be the surroundings. We need artists because we have a different angle of telling a story. We have a different angle of, of looking at life. This award is a prestigious award. And if you're receiving it as a young artist, it, it shows that you're actually on the right path. And for me, it's great. Equally on the right path is the Standard Bank Young Artist Award winner for music, Runette Bota. Runette is a classical soprano singer from the East Rand who celebrated her award with a gala concert at the festival. She's been studying in Germany, but she's really not been recognized in her own country. And it was felt that before she becomes too big a star overseas, she should be acknowledged at home. I am so privileged and so relieved that this concert went well. It's such a, an adrenaline, such an anticipation that one can't really put into words. There's nothing that comes close to the thrill of hearing somebody sing live. I mean, with the imperfections that there are, that's actually that makes it beautiful, that makes it come alive and that gives it such a raw beauty. Runette's raw singing talent was obvious at a young age, but it has taken years of study and sacrifice to reach the demanding world-class standards of a professional opera singer. There are very few people who really are dedicated to do the hard work in order to get the glamour that is uh, connected with performing. One has to be mentally fit, physically fit, healthy, where other people don't ever have to worry about getting ill or perhaps being tired on the next day for a performance. We really have to look out for that and it takes hard work, dedication and a lot of sacrifice. It is very difficult for classical musicians in South Africa. We just don't have the opportunities. Standard Bank really puts a platform there for young artists. The opportunity of performing, the exposure, people getting to know you and your art, it's invaluable. If music is part of one, you just have to give it to other people as well. You just have to use it in order to reach other people. And I think an artist who is selfish and does not share will never be a great artist. All winners receive funding and maybe more importantly, the vital public exposure they need to boost their careers to national and even international stardom. Oh.